Um, hey guys. This is my... Sorry about that, okay. This is my very first tutorial for, uh, how to play online for the 4.20 update on a jailbroke PS3. So, if you know that Rebug released the 4.11 spoof, somebody that I found on the internet did an update to that. It's not official, but it works great. I've been using it for a really long time. As you can see, it's Rebug unofficial PSN update package 0.7 R2. And it's for 3.55 points. And uh, if you need help getting on beyond something else, then just send me a message about that. So, as you can see, uh, I am on it right now. 4.20. Um, so, you're going to want to first open up Rebug Selector, and if you don't have that installed already, it's Package Manager, Install Package Files, PS3 Hard Disk, and then Rebug Selector 1.6.1 package. Once you've installed that, open it up. So once you're in that, you're going to want to go to normal mode if you're not already in it by pressing L1 and X and then it should say right there and just quit out of it and your system will reboot. So you're going to have to hold the button on the control again. at 3.55 so you're going to want to go to install package manager install package files standard package location and you're going to need to have your USB plugged into your PS3 with um, the Revo PSN update so just install that uh, I already have it installed, so I'm not going to install it. And if it's and if you have the 4.11 one already installed, it'll give you that message too. Just click yes, and then wait for it to install, and then go down to here. can read that if you want. Um, right there, it says 4.11, but it's not. And, uh, just click yes. I already have it installed, so I'm not gonna, but, well, I guess I will. And your screen will go like that for a little bit. Don't worry, it's fine. And then, update complete system will reboot all that. And then just press O. Turn the control back on. Now go back into the rebug selector and turn on the rebug mode by pressing L1 and circle, I believe. Yeah, L1 and circle. Say rebug up in the mode. Right there. So, uh, quit the game, and then it will reboot again. Turn the controller back on. Kinda have to do that a lot.
now go and check that it's at 4.20. 4.20 Go to your online account Unless your other one already is Turn your internet on And also, if you want to use a spoofer Or, or not a spoofer, I'm sorry Um Uh, patch walker you're going to have to change your DNS. It's um, get all the way over here. Oh, uh, that's not it. Go to manual and then set the primary at all eights, and then set the secondary at four four eight eight, and then set it as that. And then use your proxy server, and then press enter. I'm not going to use my proxy server. Actually, I will. Never mind. And then uh, sign in. And uh, there you go. You can um, play Modern Warfare 2 online, actually. Here. This is on Bypass. There you go. Late Mods Black Rain Edit. It's a pretty good patch. It has like. It has all of these different patches in the one patch. It's pretty cool. I'll put a download link for that in the description. And uh. I'll just show you online. Let me put four subs down. Okay. It might take a while to find a match sometimes, or a free for all. Okay, whatever. I'm running out of time, so. Bye, guys, and I hope this helped. Subscribe, like, and favorite. Too, please. Helps me out a lot. Okay, thanks.